Hello everybody and welcome back to Need for Speed Most Wanted. I'm your host Valenfor and we are going to get started here. We're going to get straight into the races so here we go. Let's do it. So here we go. We have two um, toll booth races to go here. So let's get this done and dusted. Here's our first toll booth. Um, we've started with the one with minimal opportunity for the police to get involved. The next one has a maximum chance for the police to get involved. We do want them to get involved because we have to get some of the bounty challenges done. Go. Okay, we have 37 seconds to get to our next checkpoint. Currently, two of six. Uh, no checkpoint in sight and only 15 seconds to go. Oh, here we go. Here it is. It was hiding from us. Right, okay. Speed up here. Take this corner. And we are heading this way. Oh my god, that's a car. Okay. We are coming up on checkpoint four. There we go. Two checkpoints left. About 40% left. And 50 seconds to go. Okay, let's push forwards here. Oh my god, that's. Nice bit of cornering there by me, I think. If I do say so myself. Here we go. Alright, let's head towards the last one. We've got just under 20% to go. Oh my god, that was close. Wow, what's that car doing? Jesus. There we go. Boom. And let's get started with the last of the races. There we go. Okay, we've got six checkpoints to pass through again. We have the most chance of the police get involved in this one. So let's see how we get on here. And then of course we need to get into a pursuit with the police in order to uh, well, get the challenges done, really. Now, I wonder how early on in this race, yeah, race, <laughs> the police are going to get whoa involved. Of course, if they don't get involved, it's not a problem. We can just start the challenge anyway, manually. Right, here comes our first checkpoint. There we go. Okay. 
Second checkpoint is just coming up. I think this is one of the ones that... I think this is one of the ones where... Uh, still getting uh, interrupted, I see. Right, okay, police are about to get involved. Here we go. Or maybe not. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, this is one of the ones where you don't get many checkpoints, but when you do start getting them there, they come, you know, one after another after another. Right, well, we managed to avoid the police back there. Managed to avoid another one there. It'd be crazy if uh, we managed to get through the rest of this race without getting involved in the police. As always, there's never one around when you need one. And then when you don't need one, like 50 sharp, it's incredible. Right, okay, we're coming up on the last two checkpoints. Here comes this one. Come on, car. Don't let me down now. Now, incredibly, we've dodged absolutely every single police car. Ah, and right at the end, that's where we end up getting tagged. Okay, let's get into it here. So, what do we need to do? We need to tag 22 cars. So, there's one tagged. Wow, and now he wants to be obnoxious, fine. He can be as obnoxious as he like, mate. There's another car. Tagged him. There's another one over there. Tagged. So that's 3 out of 22 done. 22, sounds like such a large number. Okay, we also need to dodge roadblocks and spike strips. I'm not looking forward to the spike strips particularly, but never mind, it's got to be done right, so... That was a spike strip just there. So that should have been one roadblock and one spike strip. Yes, it is. Heavies? Oh god. Oh my god. There we go. No heavies. Things are going to start getting crazy here. Let's take out the boat, wherever the boat is. I need to get rid of some of these piggies. Oh, look at that. That works out. Ow. It didn't work out quite as well as I thought it would. There we go. That's another roadblock and spike strip. Got rid of. A few more vehicles tagged there. There's another roadblock up here. Which side is the spike strips? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What happened there? I could not do anything about that, guys. We will try that again, but that was terrible. Right. 
<laughs> okay, so these things happen, right? Okay, let's uh, let's do this and let's do this properly. It has unfortunately gone and wasted my uh, bloody um, bounty level. I'm back down to one, which is stupid. Stupid game. Let's get some containment. I lost my target. Uh, I'll double back. Stand by. Right, okay. Deary, deary me. Right, I'm not gonna charge this guy, I'm just gonna head left. Delta Keep hold of him for as long as possible. Let's get the seven minutes one done. Suspect's driving a black Porsche. Moving way above posted limit. As confirmed, he's running. Code 3, I'm in pursuit. 1085, I'm gonna need a hand over here. Let's try and get a bounty up. Copy, Delta 12. I'm, I'm still really annoyed by the fact that, uh... Uh, the game just... Occasionally that happens, you get a spike strip or a roadblock, you can't, you can't get around the, the spike strip and the one area that you can break through is blocked off by additional police units that have come from nowhere. It's ridiculous, but never mind. Let's at least try and get some of these uh, challenges done here. The problem is that this these police are terrible at what they do, so I need them to trade paint. There we go. Where's the other one gone? Where has the other one gone? Ah, uh, there he is. There we go, there's another one. Took you out, mate. Oh, are you being serious? I lost the vehicle. Set up the How three. did you lose me? Members, the advisors, hey, last scene. idiot. Square. I'm here. Right, I got him. Douche. Come on. Stay it. with me, bro. Uh, get ready on a quadrant. I lost my visual. Close the gap. I'm right behind him. Let's slow this thing down. Right. Let's try and tag this guy, there we go. There's another one, tagged. There's another one, ta hey, tagged. There's another one. Tagged. Let's get the tagging done, I guess, and perhaps the seven minutes. And here's a roadblock. Fantastic. Okay. Opportunity to tag some police cars. He's gone through the block. He's gone right through the block. Right. Oh my god. I just lost my visual. Anybody know where he is? Yeah, I'm right here, mate. Try not to destroy yourself, Mr. Policeman. I need you alive. Heard it here first, folks. They're coming in hard and fast, apparently. And we've almost got up to heat level three, which will help us out immensely. There we go. Uh, we are authorized to use any means available for this guy. 
I spotted the vehicle. Better get units over here. Uh, this guy's not gonna stop. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to run a block on him. Put a roadblock out, please. Right, okay. Respect just knocked everyone out. I'm the only unit left. I need more cover out here. How? You've only just got involved, mate. Lost sight of the vehicle. Stand by. We're advised. No, no. Wait. Oh, we got him. We got him. We got him. There we go. That's another tag. Uh, let's see if we can't find some police here, because uh, this is annoying me now. We have almost got the seven minutes done. I think we'll probably just what we'll do is uh, just get this one done, right? Yeah, yeah, I think in terms of bounty now, um, the races I'm going to continue doing, but the bounty wise, I think probably we're just going to get the minimum requirements done now, guys, because. Uh, and no, that's not me skipping anything before anyone says anything, and I know I've mentioned this in a previous episode, but uh, these police chases, if there's a certain part, element of it that you don't have to do, you shouldn't do, because. Just making yourself a glutton for punishment, which is uh, something I try not to be. There we go. That's that roadblock done. Uh, I got there we go. There's a couple more cars tagged there. I need to try and tag some more of these cars. There's 15. 16. Car. Don't do anything silly. I'll forget him. Let's head this way. Okay, there's one milestone complete. Let's just burn it through there. There's another roadblock pass through. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That is another roadblock just over here. There we go. Some more cars tagged as well. Oh no, you don't. No chance, not this time. Fine. Let's go this way then. I'm not losing to you guys again. Right, there's something I can destroy. What is he? He's trying to lose this. Uh, stand by. Uh Damn right I'm trying to lose you. You guys are hellishly obnoxious. Right, okay. Uh, where can we go here? Let's take a left. Didn't want to do that. Did not want to do that. Get out of my way. Yeah, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. Let's get rid of as many of these guys as possible. Right, there's a spike strip. Let's avoid this. There we go.
I know that there was another one back there, but I'm going to ignore that for now. Let's try and see if we can outrun these guys now. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's the spike strip. You guys are probably thinking, why risk it? Why risk losing what you've already got so far? And the idea is, is that we've got this far right, let's just try and get it done. Although we've got to try and finish this in under one minute. As he's about to get back up, which I really don't want him to get. Right, now which side is the spike strip on? Ah, no spike strips, okay, fine. Ah! This is a spike strip one. Let's see if I can't get around the corner of it. There we go. And here we go. Is this a spike strip one? It is. There we go. Bounty complete. Let's turn around here. head back. We're going to go inside here. Take out this guy that's following us. Head back around and hopefully hide before they find us. Confirming suspect was last seen eastbound past I'm on him. Let's get everybody over here. You got cover units. Go three to your position. Yeah, we see him just ahead of you. Come on, hide faster. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Boom. Done. Dusted. Fantastic. And do you know what? That's exactly what we're going to do. Let's get on to this, guys. Let's get rid of Ming. Sir, circuit and speed trap. Let's go.
Okay, so here we go. We're up against Ming and his amazing Lamborghini. This guy is fast. And I mean super fast. We need to pull out all the stops on this race in order to win. It's uh, two laps and we just basically need to hope, hope against hope that this guy makes some mistakes and that we try and keep our mistakes to a minimum. So as you can see guys, he is fast. Can't always rely on taking him on the corners as well. As his car is a beast when it comes through corners. It handles amazingly. You can even I think years ago when I was playing this, he can even beat me on this straight just there. Right, that's the first lap down and we have actually retained first place through the first lap, but it's anybody's game through the rest of this, so As you can see I've just made a booby there. I'm going to try and keep uh, the NOS for the final parts of this race. I don't want to use it if I don't have to. I'll just use a little bit here, there and everywhere but generally speaking I want to be saving as much of this as possible. Okay, so amazingly, we're not doing too badly here, but we are on the last section. Wow, incredibly, that is the first race done. So then, speed trap, let's do it. And this guy, his car is built for speed, so we have to rely on getting to the getting to the finish line in front of him and with a few miles faster than him if we can. Immediately he is five miles an hour faster than us already. It's not good. We have to slow down there as well. Just had to itch my chin. Uh, I don't know what the difference is now. Almost 20 miles an hour, I think, by the looks of that. I think he's just gone and slowed down there. He's probably gone and hit some traffic, so. <clears throat> have no idea where we're heading now only a little bit behind him now in terms of uh, speed. Oh great, thanks Ming, thanks a bunch. Right, 484 miles an hour to my, I'm not even sure what I'm on. There we go, we've managed to get back into the lead here. I'm going to ignore which way he's gone. I'm going to head this way. Keep gives us a look, more of a straight. So he's made a little bit of a boo boo there. I don't really care if we just did that. That puts me 20 miles an hour in the lead there. Still anyone's game at the moment. There's still quite a lot of race left over. up on our next 
speed trap. I need to try and uh, reduce the gap here. No! Did not want to do that. Right, okay. Come on. Let's be having you. It seems to be destroying an awful lot of the local fauna and fauna. Hey! Where is he? Why is he racing on the grass? What an idiot! What an idiot! Woo! Fantastic! You are out of there, Ming. See you later. Right. You know what's coming next. Middle and right. Guys, keep your fingers crossed. Here we go. Yes! You know it. And who are we up against next? Okay, this is Webster. I believe he drives a Viper. Oh no, he doesn't. He drives a Corvette C6. It's got an awesome uh, paint job on it. So, here we go. Awesome intro. So, how does it feel? Number six on the blacklist after coming back from nothing. Who would have thought? It's got to feel good. Keep it up. So there you go. And before we get into anything here and I uh, end the episode, I'm just going to head down this way. not do that. <laughs> we are going to get into our brand new car. And we are going to make those changes I said. First, let's take a look at the performance parts what hasn't it gotten it? See, it's all... This is what I'm talking about, guys, right? Take a look at this. It has the ultimate engine installed already, and yet we haven't unlocked it. This is why you want to be beating uh, these. It's even got the uh, ultimate transmission. Now has ultimate NOS. Already has ultimate tires. It already has ultimate brakes. And amazingly, it already has ultimate. Uh, it, it has ultimate everything. Now? <laughs> so there you go. Fantastic. Okay, let's take a look at uh, body kits. What do we have? It's, he was racing in the stock body kit. Wow, really? Well, I think it's got to be that body kit, to be honest. That looks awesome. It's got to have a decent spoiler as well. Yeah, I kind of like Dragon. I'll go with that one. Hoods. What's it got in the way of hoods? I want it to look absolutely badass, so... Uh, and then since we're going colour, I don't want to go carbon fibre particularly, so... They're all kind of muscle car looking ones. Let's go for a tuner style. That kind of looks cool. Let's go for Factor X. Roof scoops. Kind of tacky. Oh, too far. Yeah, let's not go roof scoops. 
So let's say done on that. Yeah, play. And finally, paint. Oh, we could go for a pearlescent colour. So when the light hits it, it's going to change colour. That looks a little bit too bright, though, to be honest. So if you're wondering why it's got that two-tone look, it's because it already has a two-tone look. I'm liking the look of orange. I think we're going to go metallic orange. Yeah. Ah, uh, what am I doing here? Uh, vinyls. Unique. Whack a massive dragon down the side of it. Yeah, no, I don't think so. That looks kind of cool. Orange and what? Orange and red, perhaps? Orange. And... Yeah, that kind of looks kind of cool. Yeah, let's get that. Okay, fantastic. There we go. So here is our new car. And we don't need to make any more amendments to this. This is the car that will end up winning the rest of this game. It is awesome. Look at it run. I just love it. It's fantastic. It takes the corners so smoothly. Its acceleration is good. It's brilliant. I love it. So anyway, that is where we will end for today. So guys, if you've enjoyed this one, please leave a like. Please comment as well, as I love to hear what everyone has to say. And if you are new to the channel, welcome. Please subscribe. It helps to build the channel overall. Guys, enjoy those meals. Thanks for good night. Much love. And I will catch you in the next episode. Take care. Bye.